Earlier this month, a neighbor of when a hatchet-wielding man lunged at a police officer. The department today releasing camera footage captured at the scene. WGN's Brona Tumulty joins us with details. This scene went quickly from a traffic stop for a minor violation to an attack on a police officer by an uninvolved party. That's Naperville Police Chief Jason Aries speaking in a video released today regarding a deadly officer involved shooting earlier this month. Any loss of life is tragic and our thoughts are with the family of the deceased. The man killed has now been identified as 28-year-old Edward Saman, and we're getting a closer look at what happened on the 3rd of June. It was around 11 a.m. when a 22-year veteran of the Naperville Police Department pulled someone over near the intersection of Bond Street and McDowell Road. About 11 minutes into that traffic stop, the officer's body-worn camera captures a second silver vehicle approaching. A man quickly exits the vehicle and immediately charges at the officer with a hatchet in his hand. I just been attacked. I just shots fired, shots fired. It's not clear how many times the suspect is actually struck, but backup arrives less than two and a half minutes after the officer first fires his gun. Paramedics arrive on the scene with the backup officers, begin to render aid, and transport the man to an area hospital where he was pronounced deceased. Had this happened earlier this year, though, we wouldn't have this view of what transpired because while Naperville police cares have had cameras since 2014, body-worn ones just started being issued. The Naperville Police Department just last month began issuing body cameras to its officers. Full implementation is expected by the end of June. Thankfully, though, no one else was hurt here and a third-party investigation is in full swing. An independent investigation into this incident is currently underway by the DuPage County Merit Public Integrity Team and the DuPage County State's Attorney's Office. Bruno Tumulty, WG